hi guys this is Presh from Presh card and today we are going to apply the principle of tangency um, we're going to apply it uh, in uh, drawing a hook okay um, let's go straight to the drawing um, first of all we are going to draw the um, the circles the concentric circles at the top and so we come to circle first one has a diameter of 90 we are asked to specify diameter of the circle so we just put the diameter of the circle 90 so um, we draw the second one diameter 45 okay having drawn the both of them um, we uh, are going to draw another part of the hook and then we are going to go to the base and then uh, linking the top to the base uh, is a distance of uh, 178 mm so we are going to draw this uh, this circle here this circle here next and the distance between the centers of these two circles is 178 so we draw a line from the center of this circle here down With a length of 178 having drawn that line uh, the base of this line that is the end of this line is the center of this circle here so that circle is um, has a diameter of 90 mm so we just draw a circle at the end of this of 90 mm so Having done that, we are going to draw uh, the second arc here. This arc here, uh, this arc here is um, having a radius of 90, and the center is 20 is um, 22 mm apart from the center of this circle here. So we are going to offset this line by 22 mm. So we'll come to go to modify. We'll come to offset specified offset distance 22 and then select object offset sorry that's not what we uh, uh, so, specify. so uh, specify object to offset this is the object we want to offset by 22 mm having done that the base of this line is the center of this arc of radius 90 so just come to circle center radius and then radius 90 and we done fine all right having done that um another thing we can now link it we can now link the top of the drawing to the base by drawing these lines that we can see here so first of all we'll draw this one we we'll just go to line. I'm using our intuition. We just pick uh, a point on the on the circle, and then we will draw it tangential to a point on this other circle. Pick a point here. Pick a point here using our intuition. Of course, our intuition works. <laughs> All right, then. Um, we would uh, draw this other line as we can see here this arrow pointing showing us that this line started from the center of these concentric circles linking to this other bigger circle here so we we'll just go to line pick this from the center tangential to this having done that um, we are progressing and we're progressing fine i believe um the next thing we are going to do is to get this arc and now this arc is tangential to this line and tangential to this circle so we use tantan radius that's this tantan radius specify point on object for first tangent uh, let's say 
using our intuition is somewhere within this place so we can just pick here as long as the, the tangential point and the second tangential point to be around somewhere like here and they say specify radius of circle the arc comes from the circle the radius of the arc is the same as the radius of the circle where it comes from so the radius of the circle here in question is 32 mm so it appears here so having gotten that we're progressing all right um as you can see here there's a center line here so let's draw that center line uh, okay okay then we just uh, extend it a little bit so, now that was the line okay now why why do we need this line we need this line to be able to get these two arcs here these two arcs here we need this line to be able to get these two arcs here so how do we go about that mm -hmm. so um we come to circle we pick two point uh we select the first point here and then it's asking us to pick specify the second end point of circle's diameter we don't know where the second end point is but we know the diameter of the circle since the radius is 45 that means the diameter will be 90 so we just type diameter of 90 and we've gotten it now the same thing we do for to get the second one uh just come to that place the circle pick two points uh pick the first point and then the second point is that one here we don't know so we just pick 90 and that's it we've got those two points and now you can see that there's another arc of radius 6 mm so this arc how do we get this arc we use tantan radius since the arc is tangential to this arc and this arc so we use tantan radius and we select using our intuition select one point select another point specify radius of circle 6 mm and then we've got it so uh with this we are done with the object the hook all we have to do now is to trim so we come to modify select our trim command we press enter and then we start removing or trimming whatever we don't need so we trim we're trimming 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 of the unwanted parts okay we are trimming trim this place of trim this guy this one this one all the oriented parts yes trim them off So the parts that we're not we're not able to remove using the trim command we just select them and remove them one by one Alright, with this, we have been able to perfectly draw the hook. Alright, I forgot to remove this part. Okay. Okay. 
this is the complete talk uh thanks for watching